Today I'm going to show you how to pack a pipe like a pro. Hi folks, this is Brian with another Windy City Cigars video. In today's adventure we're going to talk about the, one of the most essential skills for pipe smokers, packing your pipe properly. Now as seasoned pipe smokers know, packing the pipe is crucial to achieving a nice, even, slow burn. Now the first thing you want to do when you're going to smoke a pipe is pick the tobacco you like. A good rule of thumb is to pick a tobacco that is somewhat moist but not really wet since you want it to burn for a while and you don't want to have to keep re constantly relighting the pipe. Once you've picked your tobacco, it's time to pack your pipe. To start with, take a pinch of your favorite tobacco, which we've already discussed, sprinkle some into the bowl, not a whole heck of a lot, you're not filling it up, and then lightly tap it down with your finger or a pipe tool or whatever. Now you want a nice loose layer at the bottom which allows airflow to come through and, and allows you to draw properly. Next, take another pinch of tobacco, sprinkle it in there, and this time pack it down a little bit more tightly. You don't want it really, really tight, sort of a, a medium tightness. Okay, and then finally, one more pinch of tobacco. Now, and you want this to be snug, not really, really tight. The object here is not to pack as much tobacco into the bowl as you can, but you want this a little bit tighter this gives you a nice good start to an even burn. Now a friend of mine who used to smoke a pipe, what he would do is he'd, for this last layer, he'd take a pinch of tobacco and he'd roll it between his fingers to pre-compress it, set it on top, and then tap that down. Gives you the same effect. So you've got a loose layer at the bottom, a second layer that's me medium pressure that uh, will create slight resistance when you draw and keeps the tobacco burning evenly, and then a nice snug layer on top. Not really, really tight, but snug so that the air can flow through. So remember, you want it loose at the bottom, middle pressure in the, in the, in the between, and on top you want it firm. Um, and if it helps you to remember, think of it as rare, medium, and well done. Now once your pipe is packed, it's time to light it. Do not use a torch type lighter. This, this burns with a very hot flame. It will more, burn more of the tobacco to start with. And if you're smoking a fair amount using a torch lighter, it could actually heat up the bowl to make it uncomfortable to hold. So what you want to use is a soft flame lighter, such as the Bic or something like that. Or, for you real old school people, matches. Believe it or not, they still make them. Okay. It's best just to char the top layer of tobacco, pause for a moment, then bring the flame back over, uh, with a few puffs to get the, the, uh, the tobacco burning, then you'll be all set. So as I said, keep in mind that packing a pipe is an art form and requires some patience and some practice, so keep at it and eventually you get to the uh, layer you want. Now keep in mind that learning to pack a pipe is an art form that requires some patience and a fair amount of practice, but you're just going to have to smoke and practice it till you get it right. Now as usual, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and remember to hit that subscribe button. Thanks very much.